before we get into the video, there's a little disclaimer. This video is not here to teach you how to play. It is here for you to be able to teach your friend how to play. You might get some tips from this video if you're here to learn, but I don't know, just just check it out for yourself. <laughs> Hello, my name is Aiden. You might also know me as Epicato. Today I will be teaching you how to explain what League of Legends is to your friends who have no idea about it. Step 1. Getting them to get the game. The first thing you need to do is make them get the game. If they refuse, grab the closest block of soap you can and rub it all over your friend until they download the game. Yes, that means follow them home if they're going home like gotta make sure they download this game because it's just so amazing they might say that they'll download it just so you stop rubbing them with soap like you don't want that you want to make sure that they get the game okay they have to get the game so you follow them while rubbing them with soap make sure you get in their hair because that's hard to get out then they'll want to get it faster and um so yeah they'll forget to get the game if you don't chase them with soap that's basically what I do to all my friends. <laughs> Step 2. Builds. Okay, good. Now you should be in a game with them. This is where this guide gets, starts to get a bit juicy. Right when you enter the Summoner's Rift, explain what a build is. This is urgent. You can't have your friend not know how to build their champion. This can get challenging to do, so just have patience and stay determined. <laughs> You should get your friend to write down all the items you tell him or her to buy. So then if they play it later on, they will know what to build. If they don't know how to buy the item, just say, Press the buy button. Because this game is pretty intense when you first log in. Like, there's a bunch of flashes, sort of, as you enter the Summoner's Rift. And it just gets pretty distracting. So just teach them how to open up the shop. Uh, buy items and make sure they get their starting items so like Doran's blade health potions and the warding trinket so now that your friend knows how to build you need to explain the lanes most likely your friend will be playing ash considering that's the first champion that they use due to the tutorial so try your best to go the support role that way you can like teach them better like then you'll like be there for them and be able to see what they're doing and how bad they are unless if they're naturally good normally they're bad i was terrible at the game like really bad but pff, pff, the past is in the past <laughs> elsa can tell you that one ah, get it elsa no no okay once you two get to the lane explain what the top lane, middle lane, and bot lanes are. For this is really important information. Show them the map and when to transition to a different lane. So like, say um, you need to go to middle lane for whatever reason, for like a gank or something, just tell them, just make sure it's clear when to leave the lane and not to stay in it the whole entire time. I'm just gonna leave the jungle out of this guide because um, they, they won't have to worry about it till they're like a higher level um it'll just get really confusing for them considering in bots you play two top which is dumb but whatever <laughs> now that they get an idea of what the lanes are um let's let's move on to minion waves explain um explain to them how you have to position yourself with the min minions and not get too far ahead of them teach your friend how to last hit minions because then they will get more minion kills and money minion kills are called cs so if you're new and you're watching this just just know if your friends like get the cs it means kill that minion so now that we're done with all this minion stuff let's go on to the next step which is turrets turrets will confuse your friend because They'll probably dive a turret in like their first few games, like chasing after the champion because they're like a mindless zombie out in the battlefield because they have no idea what to do. So they'll dive the turret, they'll get shot, they'll be like, Whoa, how am I taking so much damage if they aren't even attacking me? And that's when you come in. Your part is to be like, run away from the turret range. You see that red circle you're running right through? Red means don't go in that area they should know that they will take damage from the turret but just make sure you sum everything up about it like when to leave the turret range if you attack a champion in its range the turret will target you blah 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 just remember this game is supposed to be fun 
If you yell at them and boss them around too much, they will most likely not want to play anymore, or just not play with you in general, because you're a terrible person. <sighs> yeah, it's just, we don't want that. We, we want to, we're not a good community, guys. Come on, come on. We've got to get this community better. Yeah, getting pumped. <laughs> Encourage them to play on their own. It'll develop their mindset, and they will make more mistakes so they can learn from their mistakes. Does that make sense? Yeah, 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 you get it, you get it. You know what I mean. Don't worry, they will get good at League in at least, like, two weeks with a good teacher. And so just, like, make sure that you don't suck at teaching them. Final step is the big step. Now that your little child is grown all up, it's finally time to fight with them in some PvP. You will have to explain that turrets won't show their range and that your friend will probably have to memorize like the turret range. Uh, you know how in bots it's like a circle and in PvP you don't see the circle so your friends will have to memorize the range of the circle. Um, PvP is a whole new game, so make sure that they know that they will possibly struggle a lot. And make sure you know that, because nobody likes a salty friend. <laughs> when you start playing PvP with your friend, this is where you have to explain the jungling role. Tell them not to worry about it until they are able to use smite and until they're actually good at the game. That's all you need to do. This is the end of the guide. I really hope you found it helpful. Um, if you did find it helpful and you want to share it to a friend who might be trying to help a, another friend like get good at the game, be sure to share it to them uh, or share it on Twitter or anything like that. Um, but if you enjoyed this video, I'm trying to do something new that's creative. I don't think anyone's really done this. I'm not sure. If so, let me know in the comments. Um, I want to kind of do stuff like this, but I don't know what else I'll do it on. So if you have any questions, leave them down in the comments below. I check every single comment and I'll apply to everyone. But don't worry about it. It's not about the views. It's just about having good time and the people who like it. Right? Right? Yeah. Be sure to follow me on Twitter. Yeah, I'll put the links in the description below. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I will see you all in the next video.